friends welcome to netpren sasha today in this video we are going to see how objects behave when there is light in the previous video we saw about luminous and non luminous objects the objects that emit their own light that means gives out their own light is known as luminous object for example sun star lighted candle bulb etc the objects that do not emit their own light are known as non luminous object but they reflect the light that they receive from the luminous object for example table chair sofa earth moon and other planets now we are going to see how objects behave with light that is transparent translucent and opaque objects we may observe that some objects allow light to pass through them completely whereas some objects block it completely on this basis we can categorize the materials or objects into three types transparent translucent and opaque objects first we are going to see about transparent objects or transparent materials the objects that allow light to completely pass through them are known as transparent objects for example air clear water glass cellophane paper etc i have taken this transparent sheet which allows light to pass through it completely that is why you can see my hand clearly next we are going to see about translucent object or translucent materials the objects that allow light to propagate partially are known as translucent for example ice frosted glass butter paper etc here i have taken this butter paper can you able to see my hand clearly no you cannot see my hand clearly this is because the butter paper allows light to partially pass through it the last one we are going to see is the opaque object or the opaque material the object that do not allow light to pass through it completely is known as opaque object for example stone wall etc here i have taken this book this book is a opaque object because it does not allow light to pass through it that is why you cannot see my hand now we are going to see the property of light for this when we shine a torch in a dark room a beam of light travels in a straight line this is because light travels in a straight line but if any opaque object comes in the path of light the light ceases to continue its journey on a straight line path this property of light that it travels in a straight line is known as rectilinear propagation of light now let's investigate the rectilinear propagation of light through an activity for this place a lighted candle on the floor now take a rubber pipe straight and try to see the candle flame through one end of the pipe is the flame visible yes the flame will be visible through the straight pipe now bend the pipe and try to observe the flame of the candle but now the flame of the candle is not visible through the bent pipe the above observation shows that light travels in a straight line from the previous activity it is proven that the light did not reaches if it did not get a straight line path the path traveled by the light in a straight line is represented by a ray of light the arrow head indicates the direction in which the light travels a group of light rays is known as beam of light a beam of light can be convergent divergent or parallel now we are going to see parallel beam of light when the rays of light travel parallel to each other then the collection of such rays is known as parallel beam of light example of parallel beam of light is sunlight entering a room through window next is divergent beam of light in a beam of light from a small source the rays are moving away from each other such rays are known as divergent rays for example the light coming out from a flashlight the last is convergent beam of light in a beam of light from a very large source located far away meet at a specific point then it is known as convergent beam of light for example the right rays that enter our eyes converges at our retina thank you for watching my video please like share and subscribe my channel also leave your comments below i'll meet you in the next video with the continuation of light shadow and reflection until then bye bye from sasha